Hello everyone. In this video, we will explain you how to process biometric TSE. Through biometric option, you can only process individual DSE. In biometric process, video verification is not required. Now, in order step, please select the bio, biometric product to continue. Here, you need to enter applicant's mobile number, email, PAN number, and now you can click on the next for the further process. Now, to run the biometric device, first you need to install the Capricorn biometric in your system. After biometric device driver and Capricorn application installation, you need to click on click here to connect bio devices. Now, you need to run the Capricorn biometric application for connecting the device with your Capricorn Cash login. When you click on the click here to connect bio devices, then a pop-up appears in front of you. Please wait, we are searching connected biometric devices. Once the RD service driver is searched, it will redirect you to the new page. Further process and estimated search time will be around 2 minutes. After this, if RD services is not found in your system, please install RD services and try again. This pop-up reappears in front of you. That means you need to reinstall the RD service driver of the biometric device. After that, restart the system and then try to connect the device. After the device is successfully connected, enter applicant's Aadhaar number, select the finger, accept the terms and conditions, click on the scan and put the selected finger on the device. Once the finger scanning is completed, click on the next button to process further. The Aadhaar data will be shown. Now click on the next tab to process the DSE. Here you need to fill in the required details such as applicant PAN number, email and mobile number which is linked with Adha. Further, mention EKYC ID and EKYC PIN. Now please press on get OTP. Here after this, applicant will receive OTP on his mobile number which is directly linked with Adha. Now fill in the OTP and mention the download key. Now select the payment option and proceed further. The next step is user verification. Here, you need to verify the applicant's email. After this, your order ID is completely generated and now you can send it to our chat and support for the verification. Thank you.